Elaborating on the initiatives in the 2018-19 budget at a press conference, Secretary for Food and Health Professor Sophia Chan announced details of the Voluntary Health Insurance Scheme. She said participating insurance companies will offer private hospital insurance plans that are certified by the Food and Health Bureau. Such products should offer guaranteed renewal up to 100 years of age, have no lifetime benefit limit, and have a 21-day cooling-off period. Coverage will extend to unknown pre-existing conditions, ambulatory procedures, and inpatient psychiatric treatment. If you compare the uh, current uh, current uh, insurance scheme, hospitalized uh, hospital insurance scheme, versus our new. Uh, uh, VHIS uh, standard plan, uh, you would find that, that actually there are more uh, incentives in terms of uh, coverage, in terms of uh, protection uh, that we have included, whereas the current, uh, pro uh, current insurance uh, have not included uh, those items. So I think this is the major incentive. Of course, uh, the tax deduction is another uh, incentive. Premiums paid by a person for themselves and their dependents can be deducted. The deduction ceiling is $8,000 per insured person annually. There is no limit on the number of dependents eligible for tax deduction.